Yeah, that's called heart-shaped glasses. Wow. Marilyn Manson, Twiggy Ramirez is here as well. Marilyn, did you write that song for uh, someone in particular for a reason? Or not? Well, uh, Evan and Rachel Wood. I like that we say her full name. Right, every time. I like it. Yeah, I wish she had like a clue. junior or like a three or something <laughs> so it could be extra long. Uh... Uh, she showed up uh, to meet me at one point during a uh, illicit rendezvous, and she was wearing heart-shaped glasses because she obviously knew the humor in the relationship, you know, oddity and mm-hmm. Lolita related. So the year old enough to be her father. Oh, ooh, ooh, yeah. Oh, you want to throw down like that? that? I'm That's old enough cool. to be your mother. Um, I am your mom. All right, fine. So I, I, I sent her that as a, a email, the lyrics to that song, just as a threat. Mm-hmm. But it was that, that's why I like this song, because it's so poppy, but yet it's violent, because I mean it. It really promotes violence towards sun, sunglasses or eyewear. If there's any sort of romance problems, I think that you sh- should... You know, break the glasses. Evan Rachel Wood got a song written about her, and then uh, can you write? Can you write a fake one for me that I can p- pawn on as my own to a girl to get a girl? Because I have no, I'm not doing well. I don't think there's any song that's gonna make that happen. Probably right. We gotta go to a break. <laughs> Marilyn Manson and Twigger here. Doctor Drew, he does just fine in his world. I'm just sitting over here. We'll be back in a minute on Love Life. Eight hundred love one nine one. <laughs> Welcome back to Love Line. Striker, Dr. Drew, Marilyn Manson, and Twinkie Ramirez are here. They're friends again. They're, ma- they're, g- they're going to make music. They're going on the road together. They're going to be playing songs. Absinthe is legal in the States now, isn't it, Marilyn? Well, they have the very Americanized version of it that doesn't contain wormwood, which is the, in lure, the, the part that I enjoy. See, you bring this guy in. He's cousin uh, you know, we're not supposed to pay attention to that, remember? You I know, but it's distracting to me. Now, uh, I have my own absence called Manson. Unacceptable. And I think that I probably only uh, made it to, uh, so I wouldn't have to buy it all the time. And is it for sale on the Internet? It is. Manson. Manson. What well, color it is clever? it? Yes. It's green. Okay. I think I've had it. Probably. It's just like, well, we won't name names. Okay. But, uh, you know, it's, I don't like alcohol. I don't like anything. And I don't like anything either. I don't, I don't like, like alcohol you. as, you know, separately. I've had my experience with Jack Daniels, then I had my experience with vodka, tequila. I really try to avoid, and I'm not even talking about that reality show, girl. But just, <laughs> uh, that's, that stuff gets you just simply drunk, but absinthe has a different effect because of the wormwood. But the stuff in America wow. doesn't have wormwood. Mine does. Soon it will be legal in America. They'll sell it right next to uh, the thing that kills bugs in your yard. Got it. <laughs> How do they sell it without the wormwood? I thought that's what it was made from. Uh the the the, his, the brief history of absinthe the the Pernod brothers, one uh, went and made Pernod, which is a liqueur that's green. It doesn't have wormwood. One made absinthe, and the reason it was banned wasn't because Van Gogh cut off his ear. It was because it was distilled improperly. But you will end up like me if you drink it. So buyer beware. Now, bl- like you, looking like you, acting like you, or tasting like you? All of the above. All of the above, okay. Which I wouldn't recommend any of that. Yeah, okay. unless, th- unless that's your thing. But I've heard, I've read other things, that you're a fine-tasting man. I don't know. What, where do you hear this? What, I, I what, 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 what are you on? Um, what? What? What, 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 what you mean what, if you were to bite what blog, piece of, what blog were you reading on <laughs> that? If you were to consume a piece of him? And, Not necessarily and chew consuming a, fine a piece of him. Yeah. Yeah. A again. fine tasting man. A fine, a human, a fine a tape taste. Recorder out there, wow. Me off. Jay, right. I appreciate that. Yeah, it was you good probably had a Can you read my publicist? Some pineapple juice. No, 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 no. no, yeah, no I know pineapple juice. Yeah. Yeah. Jay, yeah, what's up, man? You're on Loveline. Hey, how's it going? Good, how are you? I'm doing all right. I got a question for you. Yeah. So, I have been dating this girl for maybe eight, nine months. 
Yeah. <laughs> Did he say beating or dating? Get it together, Jay. Here we go. Eating. Yeah. Eating? Yeah. Beating or dating? Dating. dating. Oh, oh, dating. Yeah, yeah, Sorry. Yeah, eating. Yeah. <laughs> eating. Um, and so months. I've been dating her for eight or nine months, and just recently, in the last couple months, she's been acting kind of strange. Um, right uh-huh. during Christmas, uh, I went up to go visit my dad, who's in the Special Forces, and had just gotten back from Iraq, so I went to go stay with him and go see him for a week. And while I was on that trip, um, I got a strange call at night. She was kind of freaking out and was kind of talking and was um, was basically saying that she wanted to break up. And her reasoning for it was um, she felt guilty because I was putting a lot into it. Welcome to women. And she was sleeping with half the community probably. Well, here's there's a theory that we we keep around here. This is Marilyn Manson. Sorry to butt in, but... uh, don't date girls around the holiday season. <laughs> yeah. You know, you break up with a girl right before, like right around Thanksgiving, mm-hmm. and then you don't get back together with Edward them Martin. until af- yeah, until after, after th- yeah. Valentine's Day. It saves a lot of trouble and money. Stress. And also I found out that if a girl is upset and crying, give her 10 minutes, and whatever the problem is, it'll go away. You just let her but cry it out. PMS. You know that thing where you're not supposed to hold babies when they cry at night? Mm-hmm. What's that called? Coddling or something. Same, same, same works. Let them manage their own feelings. Yeah. So yeah. if you fight with your woman, and you you do something that makes her start crying, you just back away for fi- for mm-hmm. how long? Well, no. If you start a fight, you yeah. gotta finish it. Okay. You know, <laughs> be like a heavyweight <laughs> boxer. Of but women. it's usually right. re- revolves around PMS, and and women's hormones usually make them want to be nasty. Don't mm-hmm. use profanity to you. Mm-hmm. You know, during their PMS, and my hormones. Or men's hormones make them make me want to have sex with everybody. Do men have hormones? And I refrain. I, I, I refrain from that. Well, sometimes. How do you do but that? But they don't. No, you know, no. That's a relationship, though. Hey Jay, so what is your question? This girl, after eight months, said you're giving so much relationship. She's not. And your question is? Well, she said she feels guilty, and then she pulled the whole. Well, I still want to be friends, right? Ooh. Ooh. Run for the hills. You know, man. I mean, I tell you, relationships. Bruce Dickinson. Re- said, relationships the are like cocaine. It always seems like a good idea. It always ends in tears. <laughs> well, the did search. You just, you he, just almost he almost did. He almost did. All right, you're, oh, no, you're in the you're in the you're basement. You're in the basement. You're in the basement. You're in the basement. You're in the basement. They're resetting your mic. All right. Uh, so Marilyn Manson, Dr. Drew, and Strikers here. Twiggy's in the basement. Um, I think I didn't understand his question. Still, I really don't. She just she point, she just wants to be friends. All right. Yeah. So for whatever she says, it's all BS. Right. It's whatever it is. It's she, she wants. BS. Yeah, it's like what, what's the the uh, comedic phrase, which is, uh, "It's not me. It's you. I don't like you. <laughs> I'm just done. She's just done. That's it. Right. And at 18, by the way, guys and girls, no, it's, it's hard you, to break it's up. me. I don't like you. That's it. It's hard to tell someone it's over when you're 18 or 19. At tw- 25, 35, 40, when you know it's done, you, you know it's done. If you're dating a 40 year old girl, you're in trouble. Depends how old you are. Yeah, if you're 70, it's great. I would sleep at once. See now, see, see. Doctor Drew's got good advice sometimes. Very good. <laughs> God, and you're a best-selling author. I'm jealous. Let's go to uh, uh, Beth. It's calling from New Hampshire. What's up, Beth? You hear her calling. Hi, how are you? Good. How are you? Good. I have a question for Marilyn. Yes. Um, I'm right in the middle of the book, The Long Hard Road Out of Hell, and I'm wondering how accurate it is. It's about as accurate as... Well, I, I, the only reason that I changed any of the facts was to avoid legalities, but I had to under-exaggerate. So all the stories are, are, are less than what really happened. So right. I didn't I didn't make yeah. things sound worse. It's right. my it was really worse than what I wrote because right. I would probably be in prison for what happened. Hey, what's the uh, what's the craziest story you've read in the book so far? The Long Hard Road Out of Hell by Marilyn Manson. Well, I got to tell you, the weirdest thing was the whole grandfather thing. <laughs> yeah, the, well, that which know, is what explain. Oh uh, no, it's uh, well, it's how I started yeah, the story. Explain, but that, that uh, was, I that grew was up. Part having a weird experience with my grandparents and I don't have any grandparents really now and in fact my family has kind of been reduced 